with these types of printers, you're going to need a post-processing workstation. That's going to include safety measures like the face masks, maybe more than one, or depending on your quality of face masks. Latex gloves. I bought these um, 100 packs. I bought two of them on eBay for like 15 bucks. A spray bottle. This I got from the dollar store. And this is for alcohol. And you can spray it everywhere. The tools that you use. Uh, the table just to clean everything with alcohol. You're going to need plenty of paper towels. Uh, because you go through them really quick. You're going to need some brushes so that you can clean your part. These are nylon brushes. Um, I just have these miscellaneous tools laying around. You're going to need some flush cutters to cut out the support from your print. And you're going to need a spatula and this came with the printer itself. I have a UV lamp just in case I need to cure parts if I'm printing late at night and there's no sun I can cure it with this and you're gonna need some Tupperware some buckets to hold water and alcohol these um, were also from the dollar store and I like these because they're disposable over time the resin builds up at the bottom and just gets sticky or everything's sticky um, you can just dispose of this however you want to and replace it just by buying these at the dollar store and then they're cheap and they'll do the job so this is an overall view of my workstation and what I use to clean out the parts so first thing I'm going to do is refill my spray bottle 